Our study is a study working with LGBTQ plus older adults in the Indianapolis community who receive health care at Eskenazi Health. This study is really important to me because the aging LGBTQ plus population has been shown in, in other studies to delay their care, to sometimes not even seek health care for health concerns because of fear of prejudice and discrimination. A really important outcome that we're hoping for from this is that we'll be able to demonstrate the feasibility of this health promotion intervention that we are testing in our current study. If we're able to demonstrate that it's feasible, then we'll be able to implement this with more people from the community and possibly and other sites throughout Indiana and perhaps throughout the United States. We want to really define the best way to recruit LGBTQ plus older adults to research. I think that this group of adults is often forgotten and, and overlooked. Many of them survived or lived through the HIV epidemic. They lived at a time when who they were could have even been illegal. Many of them uh, who survived this have some long-term repercussions of that. And so that survival strategy, you know, in many ways has benefited them because of their marginalized identity and help to protect them. But with healthcare and aging, it's now coming around full circle. And so it can sometimes be harder for members of this community to identify a healthcare power of attorney or a healthcare proxy if, if they need somebody to help them with their healthcare because they're more isolated. Once I started to look into this group a little bit more and realize how isolated they can be and how in many ways they're not really identified or research with them isn't really um, as likely to be pursued, I decided to start focusing some of my aging research on this group. Regan Streif in the past few years has really recommitted itself as an institution to health equity and addressing health disparities in our community through the work that, that we do and that Regan Streif supports. I feel that the project that we're doing to address the health disparities of LGBTQ older adults really fits right within Regan Street's overall goal of improving the health equity of this population in the Indianapolis area and beyond.